So what is the law of sines? I'm going to label this triangle over here. Let this angle be A. I'll let this one be B. I'll let this angle be C. And then now I'm going to label the sides. So opposite of angle A, I'm going to label this side little a. Opposite of angle B, I'm going to call this side little b. I'm going to call this side opposite of angle C, little c. So what's the law of sine say about all these sides and angles? Well, it's very simple. I'm going to write it down. So all it says is if you take the sine of A, angle A, and divide it by little a, which is just the side, that's equal to, if you take the sine of B, angle B, and divide it by side B, which is also equal to the sine of angle C, divided by side C. So basically all the law of sine says is that if you take the sine of an angle and then divide it by the opposite side, that constant is going to be the same for every single side and angle that you do this with. I also want to point out something. Notice how these are all fractions that equal to each other. That means you can also flip it and do it the other way around. So what I mean by this is you could also write this as a divided by sine a is equal to side b divided by the sine of angle b which is also equal to c divided by the sine of angle c. So you can use either one of these when you're doing the law of sines. Either one is okay. 